Hello everyone. Welcome to MSFTI webcast. In this video, we are going to see the steps on how to manage Google Chrome settings using Chrome Administrative Templates in Intune. Microsoft Intune admin can manage Google Chrome web browser settings from Intune using Settings Catalog and Administrative Templates for Windows devices. Previously, we have to create a custom OMA URI device configuration policy to configure Google Chrome settings on Windows devices. To manage Google Chrome web browser, there are two ways to create a profile using a template or the settings catalog. The settings catalog has more administrative template settings available. Administrative templates are built into Intune and don't require any customization, including OMA URI. As a part of your mobile device management solution, use these template settings as a one-stop shop to manage your Windows client devices. The Intune administrative template for Chrome will give you the same group policy creation admin experience from a modern management perspective. First step is to create the administrative template configuration profile which will contain all of configuration settings for Google Chrome web browser. To do this, log in to the Microsoft Endpoint Manager Admin Center. We can access Microsoft Endpoint Manager using the URL https endpoint.microsoft.com. On home page, click on Devices. Under Policy, click on Configuration Profiles. Click on Create Profile Plus icon. On the Create a Profile blade, under Platform, select Windows 10 and Later. Select Profile Type as Templates. Click on Administrative Templates. Click on Create. On the Basics page, enter a descriptive name for the new profile. We have given name Taste Google Chrome Customization Policy. Optionally, enter the description for this policy. This configuration profile policy will deploy Google Chrome policies using administrative templates to Windows devices. Click on Next. On Configuration Settings page, we will find all the configuration settings related to Windows devices. Here, under Computer Configuration, I'm going to click on Google. Now click on Google Chrome. Remember, we are using computer configuration, not user configuration. Now select and configure the settings you want in your policy. First, search for bookmark. Click on Manage Bookmarks. This setting will add bookmarks in Google Chrome web browser on our client computer. We can use this example code to create our own bookmark list. Let me select radio button to configure this setting. Next, we need to paste the code like this to create bookmark on our Google Chrome web browser. Let me paste the list. Click on OK. Here we can see Manage Bookmarks policy setting is enabled. Next setting is Action on Startup. Search with Action keyword. Click on Action on Startup setting. Enable the setting and from drop down list choose Restore the last session. If we enable this setting, that means when user next time open Google Chrome web browser, it will restore the last session. So whatever tabs were open in the last session, those will be restored. Click on OK. For security purpose, we want to block saving passwords. We can configure Enable Saving Password to the Password Manager policy. Let's search with password. 
click on the policy name enable saving password to the password manager this time we need to select the setting to disable and click on ok next we want to restrict devices to download dangerous content search for download click on allow download restrictions policy click on enable and from the drop down list choose block malicious downloads and dangerous file types click on okay state is changed to enabled for testing purpose this is enough using the same steps you can configure the settings as per your organization's requirement i'm going to click on next to continue in this example we will go with the default scope tag on the assignment page add the azure ad group on which you want to target click on add groups to select our test group we have created one test device group named test win client from the list select test win client group click on select and click on next on the review plus create page we see a list of settings we configured for google chrome click on create and wait for confirmation message we can see the confirmation message policy test google chrome customization policy saved successfully click on refresh to see the updated list we have our policy test google chrome customization policy the next time when our device is checks in with intune the policy will start applying on our devices to see the result let's go to a windows 10 device first we will perform manual sync with intune click on sync this windows 10 device is a member of our test device group test win client so the google chrome customization policy will apply on this device okay last sync was completed successfully to see the results quickly i'm going to restart this windows 10 device after restart let's again sign in to this windows 10 device open intune sync page now click on info after policy synchronization we can see google chrome policies have successfully applied on our windows 10 devices here we can see 1 2 and 3 total 3 policies are there we also have one more policy for firefox from the last video Let's open Google Chrome web browser. Click on this three dots, and at the end of this menu, we can see the message "Manage by your organization," as some of the settings are coming from Intune. First, we will check for bookmark. Click on bookmarks. Take mouse pointer over Microsoft portals. we can confirm that all the websites are present in bookmark which we have added in the policy we can also open the bookmarks from here okay again click on these three dots a click on settings and click on startup here again we can see the message your browser is managed by your organization we can see startup action is set to restore the previous session here we can see this option is selected continue where you left off this means the policy is successfully applying on a windows 10 device but still we want to confirm it from microsoft endpoint manager admin center so let me minimize this and let me again initiate one manual synchronization with intune let's go back to Microsoft Endpoint Manager Admin Center. Let me click on Google Chrome Customization Policy. On the monitor, click on Device Status. 
Here we can see this policy is currently applying on our device lab wind hyphen CLI01 and deployment status is succeeded. From Microsoft Endpoint Manager, we can also confirm that the policy is successfully applying on a Windows 10 device. That's all for this video on how to manage Google Chrome settings using Chrome administrative templates in Intune. Thank you all for watching this video. Have a nice day.